Okay, so the question wants to know the concentration of our KOH, which is potassium hydroxide, in a solution containing 1.6 grams of potassium hydroxide in, in a 500 ml solution. To be able to calculate this concentration or this molarity, we need to know the number of moles we have per liter. So to be able to do this calculation, we're going to have to look at the number of grams that we have here and first convert that to moles. And then we'll divide that number of moles by our volume. So we need to start by calculating the molar mass of our potassium hydroxide. So let's look at our elements here. We have potassium, we have oxygen, and we have hydrogen. And we need to calculate the molar mass, the mass for one mole of our potassium hydroxide. So if we add up our atomic masses for our one element of potassium, our oxygen, and our hydrogen, we get 56.1 grams for one mole. We only have 1.6 grams, so let's see how many moles that would be. So we will calculate that using our conversion factor here that we just calculated from our molar mass here. Notice that our units cancel out, giving our final answer in moles, which is what we need. So we would have 1.6 times one divided by 56.1, giving us 0 .0285, 0 0.0285 moles. Okay, great. So now we want to be able to calculate the molarity. But remember, our molarity needs to be divided by our volume in liters. They've given us our volume in milliliters. So let's take a minute to convert that. 500 milliliters times our conversion factor, which states that one liter is a thousand milliliters. Notice again, our units cancel out here, giving us our final answer in liters, which is what we need. So 500 times one is 500 divided by a thousand will give us 0 0.5 liters. Okay, great. So all we need to do is divide the amount of moles we have by this volume. And that gives us 0 0.057. That would be the molarity, the concentration of this particular solution.